leaving the dance floor tonight is... Naz. Come on over, Naz. We've got a very, very unhappy crowd here tonight. Well, she became a household name as the runner-up on The Bachelor Series 2, but her run with Dancing with the Stars was plagued by sickness and injury, and it came to a bit of a dramatic end on Monday night. Sorry that you're here, but welcome to the cafe, Naz and Tim. Yes, welcome. <laughs> it is, it's, it's nice to chat with you, but I mean, if you've had a couple of days to digest it all now. Does it still sting that, you, that you're out? Um, it's still a little bit of a shock to us, to be honest. Yeah, but it is what it is. Just... Well, considering how long you lasted on The Bachelor right to the end. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, considering... I, can't, I can't be greedy now, can I? True, and true. considering you could also dance, which, yes, you know, yes. some other people at that show cannot. <laughs> <laughs> no, I thought that. I thought you... I mean, I said this to Gilda last week. I thought you were robbed, because um, you did. You, a great job. You were, you were so stunning on that dance floor. Thank you. Uh, do you think there's an issue with, say, Gilda and you both reality stars? You don't have your own radio stations or your own TV <laughs> networks to, to back you. Do you think that's an issue? Yeah, I mean, it's it's hard trying to really get out there and get heaps of votes. Um, Tim and I did the best we could, and that's all we could do. Mm. Now, Tim, you uh, didn't dance on Monday night because of your knee, which we yep. saw replayed over and over again. <laughs> the fall and the catch and the wonkiness. Yeah. How is the knee now? It's, it's beautiful. I can move the leg. Easy, no problem at all. How hard was it for you to stay off the dance floor on Monday night? I was, re it, it was mentally really hard. Mm. Like, I mean, I was watching, you know, our we family um, that we became, um, just sitting there at home on the couch watching them, and it's like, just wish I was there. <laughs> oh, I bet, I bet. How did you think Naz and Shay went? Uh, beautiful. Nice. I, I love the performance. Uh, Great. Because, I mean, I've taught um, Naz the dance and uh, the technique, and I thought she nailed it. And um, I definitely thought she should have stayed in the competition. Yeah, well, you, you absolutely did. And I think everyone thought that too. You could tell by the booze at the end of the show that everyone mm -hmm. thought it was a bit of an unusual one as yeah. well. Yeah. Um, so now, so going back to when you were asked to be on the show, what was your initial reaction? Um, when one of the producers called me, I actually told her I needed a bit of time to think about it. Um, for personal reasons, of course, as well because of my last experience. <laughs> um, it wasn't the best. Um, but <laughs> um, let's not talk about that. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> you see, this is the way to sort of, re re sort of um, change the, the public image of you? Definitely, definitely. I mean, it's another risk that I was willing to take. Um, I, mm. I, I didn't know how it was going to go, but... I saw it as an opportunity to not only dance and perform and have fun and um, raise money for charities, mm. but also uh, to yeah show New Zealand who I really am. Yeah. And, and that's the thing, Naz. I'll have to say that, you know, the two years since we've done The Bachelor, people go, what is Naz like? And I always go, she is absolutely lovely. And I've backed you and said that the whole way. And Thank it was so you. nice. I think that came across in the show. I mm. think, you know, you did a great job with that. Anyway, we'll move on to something else. I was curious, what do you notice about your dancing when you sit back and watch it? It's good. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. And she's back. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta you gotta back yourself, I reckon, hundred percent if you're gonna do and do a show like this, because it must be extremely yeah. difficult. And yes. what were your fitness levels like? Because I would take it that you'd be pretty fit going into this. How did you feel with the dancing? So going into this, I thought I was gonna be okay considering my fitness levels are pretty mm. good. Mm. Um, but I was wrong. It's just yeah, <laughs> <laughs> all the different postures, the movements in Latin, just yeah, muscles I didn't even know I had um, started hurting. It was yeah, knots in my backs and everything. It was difficult, very, very big challenge. But I got the impression you were very determined to push through all of that pain, like standing mm. on your tippy toes. Oh <laughs> my god. He was <laughs> it literally felt like just he was the way breaking teach. them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was, you know, when I have a goal, when I have something to work towards, I give it 100%. Doesn't matter about the pain mm. or whatever it takes to get there, I'll just do it. What yeah. do you prefer, fast dancing or the slow dancing? I like ballroom. Okay, right. Yeah, so there's fast and slow in ballroom, yep. mm. but I like ballroom. Because yeah. yeah, I thought you were great at the tango. Yes. What do you think, Tim? Is she yeah. better at the faster or the slower? She's definitely a ballroom girl. Everybody, yeah. including me, thought she was going to be a Latin girl. Yes. You know, moving the hips yeah. and stuff like this. Shaking it all. But <laughs> when, when I actually put her into the posture, and it's like, you know, do this, do the shape, do, do, do all of that, I was like, 
Wow, she's a yeah. ballroom girl. Because people always talk about you've got to do the whole extent thing, and you seem to do that. Well, not that I know. I'm, <laughs> I'm watching Dance with the Stars, so maybe I should be a judge. Oh, we're all uh, critics watching, aren't we? Uh, <laughs> so, what for you? Um, are you going to continue with the dancing? Is that something that you really like? Is it yes, going to be? Yes, I'm definitely going to continue. So, Tim's going to continue teaching me, and hopefully, we'll do some competitions in the future. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's really quite exciting. Yeah. I think you're the first person we've ever spoken to from Dancing with the Stars or that's been on that's actually continued it. Really? No, I love dancing. I've done it since I was young or for a little bit in Talent Quest in primary school <laughs> um, and in high school a little bit as well. I've just always loved it. My um, In my family, performing is in our blood. So, yeah, I yeah. enjoy it and I'll continue it. And I like that. You know, you always do give 100% to whatever you do. So it's great to see that you'll carry it on because I thought you were quite good at it. Um, who do you get more nervous talking to at, in the show? Is it Di or is it Sharon? Neither, really. Oh, you get on with them both? Yeah. Okay, yeah, cool. They're Lovely. awesome. Yeah. yeah, everyone's a wee family. And they're not there to be mean to you either. They're there no, to No, everyone you. is so nice, including me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so people obviously say they vote for you. Oh, Naz, I love you. I voted for you. Have you ever challenged them and asked to see the text on the phone? <laughs> No, I didn't, no. But I have been sent screenshots of people voting. Oh, I have had so much support from the public on social media this whole week. It's been incredible and something I'm not used to. So it's, yeah, very nice. Okay. Yeah. Well, last question for yeah. you both. Who do you think is going to win this? I don't know. After You know what? After my know. elimination, I'm just like, hmm, it's anybody's <laughs> game. Yeah. Tim? I mean, dancing-wise, I thought she definitely was top two or three. Same. Mm -hmm. 100%. Mm -hmm. And um, apparently, since, you know, we're eliminated, I just don't know. Yeah. Oh, it's wide open. Hey, well, it's been really nice having you both here. Thank Thanks you so much. Thank you. Yeah, good to see you're on Thank the men too, Tim. Yeah, great yeah. effort, Naz. Proud Thank of you. you. Make-A-Wish Foundation will be very pleased yeah. with you. Thank <laughs> you. Make sure you keep watching Dancing with the Stars Sundays at 7, Mondays 7.30 on 3. And you can always catch up on any episodes that you've missed on 3 now.